US scientists have used high-tech research tools to identify the remains of four leaders of Jamestown, the New World's first successful English colony, more than 400 years after they died. Uh, we have discovered four of the first founders of English America. This is the earliest English church in America, 1608, uh, and without any question, the four men buried in the chancel between 1608 and 1610 are four of the first uh, leaders of the whole English enterprise in America. These men, in various ways, witnessed the first uh, three years of the establishment of the colony. They endured uh, food shortages, starvation, Indian attacks and uh, disease. The men were identified as Reverend Robert Hunt, Captain Gabriel Archer, Sir Fernando Wayneman and Captain William West, all of whom helped guide the colony during its difficult years after its founding in 1607. The four were found buried within Jamestown's 1608 church, which fell into disrepair in 1617. The burials were investigated in November 2013. Researchers used archaeology, skeletal analyses, chemical testing, 3D technology and genealogical research to identify the men who lived and died when the settlement was on the brink of failure due to famine, disease and war. Researchers also conducted chemical analyses to examine diet, the presence of heavy metals and the men's origins. The styles of coffins and artefacts also led scientists to identify the remains. Hunt, who died at about age 39 in 1608, was the first Anglican minister at Jamestown. Archer died in late 1609 during the Starving Time, a period when about 250 settlers died from disease, starvation and Indian attacks. Wayman died at about age 34 and was the cousin of the Virginia governor, Sir Thomas West. Wayman was the first English knight to be buried in America. And William West died at about age 24 in 1610 during a skirmish with Powhatan Native Americans. Scientists found scraps of a military leader's sash near his body.